welcome back to the channel. So today, my video isn't just trying on stuff, it's not just a haul. My video is me trying to upgrade what I wear daily for work, kind of not really going down a couch or wardrobe type thing, but I have been sorting out all of my stuff over the last couple of months, and my god, I am just, every time I go back into my closet, I'm finding more and more and more that if I don't wear, you know, is optimistic, I'll keep that because I'll get down into it one day, I'll slim into it one day. And I just, I am sick to death of getting up in the morning, having like three, four, five times as many clothes as Dan and thinking, I have got nothing to wear. I'm sure you guys know the feeling of getting up in the morning, trying to get ready for work, being half asleep while you're doing it and going, I've got nothing to wear. Even if you get something out the day before, you'll never, ever, ever fancy wearing it because you're having a fat day, you're having an off day, you don't like that colour on that day. So, you know, the struggle is real. So I thought, I am going to up my game. And I am going to go smart. Not too smart, just smart enough. So I don't have a uniform per se for work, but I do need to look smart. So, this is where my idea came in. I absolutely love the smart, casual look of wearing blazers, jeans, shoes. Absolutely loved that, always loved it, always wanted to be one of those women that could rock a blazer with jeans and high heel shoes. So, can't really wear high heels at work, but you know what I'm saying. So I thought, Shein, let's see what blazers they've got. So. I'm really, really excited to show you what I've got. I'm really excited to get into my wardrobe transformation and there will be another video coming quite soon, hopefully, about my great big clear out because the pile in that side of the room is getting bigger and bigger and bigger and I feel like it's just gonna end up going one day. So I do actually want to take you through my shopping experience on Shein. So I will sort of fast forward to that bit now so you can see actually what I had a look on Shein for because I did keep the price low so I wanted a, a low price so yeah let's just let's get into it and let's get into the video oh my word oh my word they have I'm literally on the website now 2337 products which match the search that I did for blazer so I'm gonna get into it I'm already on the website and I thought I'd take you and do a little bit of a shop with me so I'm gonna see how this all turns out I don't want anything cropped because anything cropped, I am um, off. Oh, really does not suit me because, yeah, it really doesn't. So let's have a look, see what they've got. I love this. Oh my god, and I love this. You're going to see how I shop now. This is so strange because when I shop, I literally go through and I go, I like this, 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 and you will literally be able to see all of my tabs along the top that I have open. That one I love. Ooh, that might be a bit short. I'll have a look. Ooh, what have we got? I like that, but I think there might be a better one somewhere. You know, look at the prices of these in the sale. Oh my god, they're like £7.49. Like, what? I really dislike crop blazers. Ooh, I love that. It's very similar to ones that I've got already. That don't fit me because coincidentally they are a size 12 and i haven't been a size 12 for years so i'll open that one that one is a nice without the two-tone i like it page two and i have my coffee obviously because i'm shopping oh stripes i like stripes i like weird patterns oh wow oh my yes Wow, that looks amazing. I like the shininess of that, which is weird. That's a blazer, apparently. Apparently, that is a blazer. I don't know. Whatever. Don't go for mint green. I think that would wash me out. Very pretty. I think it would wash me out. Let's see if they do it in other colours. No, because there's no colours along the bottom here. No. Uh, green. Guys, no, I cannot resist anything that is green. I love it. Evergreen. Man, that's... Pretty. Ooh, I like it. Okay, what else have we got? 
That looks see-through, so that's a no. Wow, 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 Oh my word. Wait, is that corduroy? I don't know, it looks interesting. Open that. Oh God, look at all my tabs that are open, that's crazy. Now that is really cute, I love that. <gasps> yes, please. Don't worry, I'm not gonna buy all of these that are on the top, that's just silly. Shein, you need to sponsor me so I can have all of these clothes. Okie dokie, come on, load. I've got so much stuff open, it's probably because I've got Photoshop open actually, and it's just like, if anybody has the Adobe Shop shopware, <laughs> software on their laptop or their computer, then you will know, you will know it takes up like, 80 to 90 percent of your CPU. It's ridiculous. No, I don't think I could wear that to work. Scroll it, scroll it, scroll it. Da -da 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 -da. Whoop, 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 whoop. Copy all around my mouth. <gasps> yes, ma'am. Oh my god, this is really bad. Oh, yep, no. No. Okay, so you may be asking why, why I'm going for blazers. I'm going for blazers because I work in management, so really wearing a t-shirt is not good. You should never wear a t-shirt. So I'm trying to upgrade my wardrobe, so I have literally like all of my regular stuff in one bit that I wear day to day, and then I'm going to get rid of all the rubbish that I've got for work, like all the all the tops and stuff, I'm just going to donate them to charity. I might put a couple that have never been worn on eBay, but we'll see. I literally just want a section of my wardrobe where it is like nice blazers, very plain tops that go underneath it. So every single day I'll go black trousers or navy trousers, blazer and a top, and that is it. So if ever I leave where I am now, which I don't plan to, it, it just means that it's a transferable wardrobe instead of me having to think I need to go out and buy some clothes for work if I ever leave so that's kind of where I'm at with that. Did I bring that up? <gasps> that is nice too. So yes that's where I'm going with with this but I think because we're in that kind of the age where a blazer doesn't have to be like a suit jacket you can kind of get in a way. God it's windy out there. Anyway, you can get away with wearing like some really, really funky stuff, which is always a bonus. Okay, so we're at £9.99. We're at £10 a blazer here. I don't really want to go over like, I sound so cheap. I don't want to go over like £15 for a blazer, because if I'm going to be buying like five or six of them, I'm going to be spending monies and then I've got to get everything else as well. So. We have to be very careful with the amount we're actually spending on these. What? It's like Tarzan and Jane wear. Maybe I should get some trousers. <gasps> oh, yes. Chin, why are you doing this to me? I cannot afford everything that I like. Oh my God, I've got so many tabs open. Nothing is loading. <laughs> so bad. Oh my God. Argyle print. Mm. I like it but it should be saved for sweaters and sweater vests when you go cold. I think I am about running out of stuff that, oh, now that, this is a look right there. I could so do that for work. I th yeah, I think I'm about there with the stuff that I like. I think I've pretty much been past everything that I really, really like. Doobie-doo, doobie-doo. Last page, page six. I'm not gonna go any further than that because there is over 2,000 items on here. So, oh my God, yes, I love that green. What is that? No, don't like that. Blah. Oh, that's so pretty. Ooh, that is a bit of me. I'm definitely getting one of those. Yeah, we're getting into jackets now. So they've stopped really being blazers. <gasps> Oh my god. All right, that's it. I'm done. I'm done. Look at all my tabs. Oh my god. Look at all my tabs that are open. This is unreal. A gingham. Oh, only one left. Only one left. That is mine. Nobody is having that. Oh my god. Red or green? <gasps> I'm going to add it to the back. One left. <gasps> that is freaking gorgeous. Please don't tell me one left. Two left. Oh my god, I'm gonna die if I don't get these. 
Right, I'm going to go through all of these and then I will be back when I check out my cart so you can actually see how much I've spent. And if I do some roll necks or some like strappy tops or whatever, then I will turn you back on and we will get busy. Okay, so I have found a couple of tops that I really, really like. And I've got one in black, one in green, and then I've got another couple as well, one in black, one in red. I thought that was really cool. Nice bit of a contrast, but a few different things. I'm not good with white because I have to wear a bra and white is always see-through. Oh my God, I hate that white is always see-through. So I have to wear like a nude bra and then a camisole and then another cami on top of that. And then it's not see-through, which is a pain. So I don't really wear white unless it's like a jacket. So this is my entire cart. Oh, it's telling me to buy eyelashes up. <laughs> and it comes to £145.36. I think I can do that. So let's do that. We are done. We are checked out. Everything is awesome. Oh my God. I can't believe I've just spent that amount of money on blazers. Oh my God. But I'm really excited to see what they're like. So as you probably tell, I got the blazers in size 16 because I want to make sure that they go over my arms because they're blazers. Sorry if I'm wiggling you around. And then the other tops, because whenever I get dresses that are size 16, they're always so big here. I thought, well, let me get the 12 to 14, so the large, and we'll see what they're like, because normally that should fit. That should fit. The reason why I get 16s is because of my lower half. Um, I have boobs, and yet a size 16 is far too big on my top half and not my bottom half. I don't understand what I'm like. Ooh, look, trousers. Trousers, jeans, I'm going to do it in a different haul. Let's wait for a little bit, wait for all this jazz to come in and then we will get to the trying on so that's probably going to be for me about a week and for you about a couple of seconds so from all of that shopping <laughs> i got not one giant bag oh, but two giant bags from shein and i'm going to open them for you right now so as you did see i did order some camis as well i'm not sure where they're going to be in these bags but i will find them and then i'll try those on first before I try the blazers on and I will leave the camis on as we go through the video so you can see what they look like and I'll try not to poke anybody's eye out with my scissors at the same time okay so haha a camisole come here little camisole let's have a look so this is the cami these ones I did actually get in a size 14 so it's a large because I know that if I got an extra large it would be too big here it would be massive so this is the wine red one really 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 love it so let's get this tried on and see what it looks like and then you may see it under some of the uh the places so this is the red cami what do you guys think i love this color i think it's absolutely gorgeous and i absolutely love how it's longer here and longer at the back and it's shorter here it gives you more of a, a slimming effect which is always really good but I really, really like this cami. It's just, it's absolutely gorgeous. So what do you guys think? So this is one of the tops that I actually got. So I decided not to get all camisoles, obviously. This has actually got some um, shoulder pads in, which is actually really quite cute. And I really like that. Again, this is a large, this was a size 14. And I'm so glad I got it in that size because I think it would have been far too big if I'd got the extra large. So you may see this under some of the other blazers and you may have already seen it so this is the top so this is the green top and i think this fits really lovely i really really like it there is like some fabric here where the shoulder pads are actually sewn onto which kind of goes everywhere but other than that i think this is really really nice what do you guys think i really like it, it is a little bit shorter than i'd normally have but i do quite like it so we have a black version of the green top absolutely love this again it's in a large so it's a size 14 with the shoulder pads so really like this let's get this tried on under some jackets you may have already seen it so this is the black top which is the same as the green again it's got that weird kind of fabric around here from where they've actually sewn in the shoulders but i do really like it i apologize for me wearing my black jeans with it but hopefully you can see it because they're different materials. I really, really like this. Again, it's a little bit short from what I'm used to, but in this case, I don't mind because it just feels so nice and it's not really tight. So this is the black camisole, the same as the red one. And again, size large, which is a 14. And you've probably seen this underneath some of the other blazers. I'm sure that you probably won't be able to really tell much of a difference between this and the top, but oh well, so yes. 
this is another cami. Yes, I know, another black cami and more black jeans, but honestly, this is gorgeous. You'll see when I try on the red one, just how gorgeous this actually is. It fits so, so well. You can barely tell that you've got it on, but it is not tight, which is really nice for saying that the camis I do actually have in my wardrobe are like a size 10 to 12 that stretch. So they are a little bit too small and I've needed a cami upgrade for a while. I absolutely adore how they are shorter here and longer here, which gives you a slimming effect, which is amazing. We all love that slimming effect. But yes, so this is the black cami. Fits perfectly. Oh my word. So in the first bag we have this blazer. Okay, okay. I'm actually really, really excited about this. I love blazers and you know what? I'm actually buying more on like eBay and of, from charity stores as well. So I'm gonna do like a, a thrift video as well. So I'm so excited. Anyway, this is Shein. So let's get into these. So far so good, good quality. And if you want to know, I have bought everything in a size 16. I would rather, if it's a blazer, be slightly too big than it not be because I do have shoulders and I have arms. So I don't want them to fit like, if you look at this shirt, it's slightly bigger here so it fit my arms in. So I don't want to go down the whole thing of it not being able to fit properly. So this is the first blazer. And I actually kind of really like it. I like it how it's not really really thick so it'll be perfect for summer i love polka dots absolutely love polka dots so that's really cool and you just have the one single button there so me me and me i will not do them up because i never do so let's get this blazer tried on and see what it looks like what do you guys think about this blazer honestly i think the arms are slightly too big but there is no shoulder padding in it so i do feel like I am gonna have to, you know, put some structure into it, maybe put some shoulder pads in, hopefully that will bring the arms up a little bit. It's not the most intriguing kind of blazer, I think it's just a very sort of meh kind of blazer. There's not really anything about it. It's one of those that if you're not really going anywhere special, uh, but you want it to look like you've made a bit of an effort, it's one of those things that you wear. I am wearing black jeans, I apologise. It's like the no-no of fashion, you don't wear navy and black, so I do apologise. But this is the kind of blazer that you would probably get away with wearing a t-shirt underneath it, and then your jeans, and you could probably wear some trainers and that would look quite funky. You definitely need some structure in the shoulders, 100%. Oh, and they were all different prices as well, so I will put the price where I normally put it, so you guys can see, and I'll link everything in the description down below as well, so you can go and have a look if you like anything. A lot of this stuff was on sale though guys, so they may not be around anymore. Okay, so this one, I am so glad, so glad they still have this in stock because I love this when I saw it. And I'm really hoping this is gonna be so complimentary to my hair. Oh my word. What do you guys think of this blazer? I am in love with this. It's got a shoulder pad. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god, it's got shoulder pads. Oh my god, this jeans, cowboy boots. I am so there. Oh my god, yes, I love it, love it, love it, love it. I think these buttons, they're actually metal, which is interesting. They are a little bit wobbly, so the stitching may need, I may need to go around the stitching again on those, but I don't think they'd fall off anytime soon. This smells like, this actually smells like. This has been kept in somebody's house for ages. You know when you get that house smell, but it's like someone that has a baby and cooks baby food as well as their own food. It kind of smells like that, so that's a little bit annoying. <gasps> and it's got fluff on it everywhere. Okay, so <laughs> I'll try this on, and if I like it, then I'm gonna have to wash it before I wear it because somebody else has had this and I think somebody else has actually worn it, so that's not very nice. Other than that, I love it! So let's try it on. So this is what the jacket looks like done up. I'm kind of living for this look. I'm getting sort of very early noughties kind of vibes with it. I am absolutely loving it. I really love this jacket. The only thing is it has got wool in the fabric and it is itching because there's no lining on it. So I may have to take it to a tailor and get some lining put in because I could not do this 
for eight hours <laughs> without lining it. Oh my gosh. That's what it looks like it's done up, so I'm gonna undo it for you guys. This is what it looks like undone. Either way, I am loving this jacket. I adore the shoulder pads. This is just, this is amazing. I absolutely adore it. Oh, love it. Okay, so the next one. Oh, that's a bit stuck. Oh my God, it's just one jacket. Oh my God, this is a hefty, hefty, hefty number. <laughs> Oh my god, I just, my wardrobe is just elevating. Every time I look at one of these, my wardrobe is elevating. Oh my lord, oh, hounds juice, I adore thee. Oh my word, this is so thick, you guys. This is such a hefty, thick jacket. This is so spring, fall, winter, and I am here for it so bad. It is so soft. <gasps> Oh my word, oh my word, oh my word. I am in love with this, oh my god. And it is like a half collar as well, so it's going to be one of those jackets you have to wear open and it is going to be slightly big, which is really, really cool, really love that. I just, I love the weight of this, it is so, so heavy and it is really thick. So, absolutely perfect for the colder days. Yes, I, I am I am in love with this. I adore it. I love it. And I'm going to try it on. So this is the houndstooth jacket and it is so lovely. It isn't lined on the inside, but it is so thick and I think that this will be really, really warm. I do like it, I really love it. And I probably could get away with doing it up, but I don't think I actually would. So this is the jacket and I am sold. Okay, so that's the first bag done, so I'm going to open the second bag, get into it, and see what else we've got. Okay, so... <gasps> I'm so excited! Do, do, do. Everyone loves cheetah print! Do, 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 do. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Oh my god, I'm so glad that they had this in as well! Because there was a lot of stuff on there that said there was only one in stock or there was only a couple in stock and I know with some shops like everything five pounds if there is like one in stock and you put your order in but then someone else has ordered like express shipping before you or or whatever it is or they've not updated their stock records properly then they just don't send you the item they don't let you know but I love this. This is a bit of me. Yes, it is. Obviously, I'm not going to do the buttons up like that because I think that looks, it just won't suit me doing it up. But I love this. And again, it is so light. This is really, really thick. going to need ironing after you wash it though, isn't it? I am in love with this print. This cheetah print does not say tacky. I don't think this says that tacky. I think it's a bit like, I'm trying to be smart and cool. But yes, I do really, really like that. So I can't wait to try it on. Oh my God, this is so wild. Oh my gosh, what do you guys think of this? Oh my word. Okay, this is stunning. Oh my gosh. It is double-breasted, so you could literally do it up and have the buttons there. I don't think that would suit me, but I will try it just for you guys. So, this does not look good on me at all. It makes me so boxy. And because I am a round figure, this is not good. So I'm gonna undo it again. But guys, I am living for this jacket. This is absolutely stunning. Again, the sleeves are a little bit longer, but again, there's no structure in it. There's no shoulder pads. So if I put some shoulder pads in it, it will just lift that structure up a little bit. Hopefully take the arms up a tiny little bit and it won't look like I'm wearing my dad's jacket but I absolutely adore how this feels on. It's so comfortable. I think it goes really well with the red, so yes to my pairing, thank you very much. And I just think it's a wow piece. So you can literally wear black from head to toe, you can wear a play suit, throw this on the top and put some black shoes on and you are there, oh my word. You are the thing that everybody sees in that room. So yes, oh, loving it. And these oversized lapels as well. Oh, I am so feeling this. 
I really hope jackets like this are up and coming throughout spring and summer because, you know, or fall, because you know jackets are more of a fall thing, so if they are, yes. Next one! Ooh, we've got white. I actually got a white jacket. Why? I am the most untidy person in the world. I'll wear this once and it will be ruined. Okay, I can see why I've got it now. This is gorgeous. This is going to be my posh jacket. Look at that, it's so gorgeous. Look at the little ruffled up sleeves, it's so pretty. False pockets, perfect for summer. It's nice and light and airy. I j'adore this. I absolutely adore it. Um, yes, I really, really like this. I think it's so cute. It, it's just like one of those jackets that's just like really quite cute and romantic, which is really lovely. A little bit, um, I don't know, Parisian chic, I suppose. But yeah, it's so pretty. I just... I have to make sure I don't get any makeup on it and I don't go anywhere where I'm going to be dirty. So, like, I can't go in Dan's van, for example. Yes. I am a liking. Let's try it on. Ooh! Short pads. I adore this. Oh my god, I need this in every single colour. It's absolutely beautiful. It fits so, so well. It feels absolutely lovely. The rouge bits, they are a little tiny bit annoying, but you can kind of get used to it. That's not a massive deal. But I was actually going to pair it with a black cami and I thought, you know what, let's go a little bit wild, let's go for green. So here it is with my green top and I adore it! What do you guys think? I really like this, I think it is so, so pretty. Okay, so I will now go in for some more blazers! What's this one? What is this? What is this? What is this? So oh, what is this? Ooh, it's like a brown! Kind of living for this colour! This is extremely light fabric. Oh my God, this is very, very summer. This is like, you need to cover up just in case you get sunburned, which is very, very me. So it is very, very thin material. Oh, that's so summery. I love the color and, oh no, I feel like this could be quite static. But again, I would not button this up. I would have it open because it is a big, oversized jacket but I really love the style and the look of that so let's get this tried on and see what this looks like especially with my hair that should be really interesting what do you guys think of this so because it is such a thin material these lapels are going to have to be ironed down so they actually stay where they are supposed to but wow I love it I don't think I would do it up because I just look weird it's around the thickest part of your body so that's not very good unless you go for a few sizes up then that would look really really cool and it'd be long and baggy but this fits perfect you would never guess that I have shoulder pads in the top underneath this as well as the little shoulder pads that are in the jacket but I am living for this. I think it's perfect for the summer and warm days in the spring. So what do you guys think? Okay, so the next one. Ooh. Oh, I am so glad. So, so, so glad I got this. I have actually been so excited about this one. Well, actually, I kind of forgot. But now I've seen it, I'm like, oh yeah, I'm so excited for it. So this is a dual colour blazer. It's not as thick as I would have thought it would have been. This is actually really cheap material, so I'm not impressed with that. But look at those buttons. Oh my God, those buttons are absolutely everything and they make the jacket. So it's dual color, so you've got your plaid here and then you've got your black on the other side. I, I really like it. I just wish that it had been a thicker material. Again, that is gonna be one of those really oversized jackets but I am kind of loving it. It's just such, wow, it's so long. You could actually wear this as a dress, which is crazy. Just stick a belt around it and you've got a dress. So let's get this tried on and see what it looks like. Overall though, I am disappointed about the fabric. I thought it would be a thick fabric, so. But let's see what it looks like on it. It may look amazing. So this is the jacket and though I like it and it is nice and it's, it's quite thin, so you could really get away with wearing it in the summer. There is no real structure to it and these buttons, you can tell that it's a really, really cheaply made jacket because the buttons are actually like hanging down low and they're not sitting properly on the material. But I do like it. I love the contrast. I like the plaid there and I like the black here, which is really nice. You could wear it with red, you could wear it with black. You could go crazy and wear it with a completely different colour. 
Yes, you could if you really wanted to, but I'm not that adventurous, so I've gone for the black underneath it. I do like it, but I think I need to put some shoulder pads in it, give it a little bit of structure. Okay, so going in for the next one. Ooh, we have a red. I like red. Oh, it's a deep red. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh, and I got spare buttons. Yes. Oh my god, yes. Spare buttons are everything. <gasps> Okay, so, look, can you roll those up? <gasps> oh my God, okay, this is amazing. Okay, so, red jacket. Got some little shoulder pads in there as well. But look at the sleeves. Oh, I love it, I'm living for this. But, you can roll the sleeves up. Boink, 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 boink. And it will look like that. I am adoring this, I am living for this. I'm not sure which one I'm going to prefer, so I'm going to leave one down and one up, and then we're going to see when I try it on. So I'm really excited about this because this is so smart with like that little flare of fun I love to talk about. So, <laughs> love it. What do we think of this jacket? I really, really love this blazer. I'm not sure what I prefer, rolled up or down, but I suppose it depends on whether you're going for smart casual or a little bit more smart. So. I love this version, say I'm wearing my blue jeans and I might wear my cowboy boots, that would look so cool. But I think this is more of a, a workwear kind of sleeve. But what do you think of this? I adore it, I love the red, this kind of red is one of my favourite colours and I just love how you've got that little spark of fun which is always really really cool. So what do you guys think of this? I am a little bit in love with this one. Okay, so the next one, this is huge. Oh my word. Okay, we've got giant hound's tooth, which is always good, and this feels unbelievable. Okay, you guys. You guys. Oh my word, this is another dual colour slash pattern. Oh my word. So this is slightly thicker. Oh, it's like corduroy. <gasps> oh, wow, it is like corduroy. Oh my God, beautiful lining in it. And it is a dual color again. It's double breasted, but I wouldn't really do it up because it's me. Oh my word, I absolutely adore this. This is, oh, this is beautiful. Oh, <gasps> yes. Oh my word. Again, it, this is really, really oversized. I could have gone a size down with this, but like I said, I want to make sure they actually fits properly. And if it's supposed to be oversized, it's going to be oversized. So let's try this one on. I'm so excited about this. So, <laughs> Okay, so this blazer, I am not so sure about. I feel like it's very, very oversized in the sleeves. And I'm not sure about that. I think if the sleeves were slightly tighter and not as long, it would look really lovely. Because you've got the oversized of the actual front here. I can do it up. And let's see what it looks like done up. Honestly, I think I prefer it actually done up, though it, I do feel like I am wearing my dad's blazer. So this one is probably a no from me, but please let me know what you think. I may just have to take it to a tailor and get it taken up because I love the contrast detail. I like the hands tooth and I like the black. So I may just get it tailored to me so that, you know, it's not massive on the arms. Okay, so the very last one, and I'm so excited for this. This is giving me, I totally forgot about this one as well. This is giving me share vibes from um, Clueless. So, oh my word. Oh, please let this one be gorgeous. <gasps> Lovely little notch color, I love it. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, oh my gosh. So we've got shoulder pads again, but wow, you guys, you guys, look at this. I think it's all a bit squiff, but when it's on, it will look amazing. This looks gorgeous. There's no lining in this though, so it may be a little bit itchy. It might be one that you can't really wear all day and it's a bit more of a summer thing. But the pattern, oh my word, the pattern is so beautiful. Oh my word, I'm, I'm loving this. So let's get this one tried on and see what this is like. Okay, so this actually reminds me of a coat jacket, but it's not heavy. You could literally wear this in spring and summer. This is so nice. Again, it probably needs lining. I need to get some lining put in the sleeves at least because it's a little bit itchy, but it is 
double breasted. So I'll do this up for you because it means that you guys can see it. It doesn't suit me, but you know, I'll put myself through this pain. So there we go, double breasted jacket. Not my thing, I like having these open. And there we go, again, I love these giant lapels. I am so for these giant lapels. You have no idea, I just think they're amazing. But I do really love this. It is giving me, it's giving me late 90s vibes. Oh my God, I am adoring this jacket. I really love this. So let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. And um, yes, hmm, very nice. So that is everything guys, what did you think to my wardrobe upgrade slash workwear upgrade haul from Shein? Obviously I didn't get any bottoms because I've not really tried on any bottoms from Shein before so I am going to have to have a little bit of a hunt and see what I can get bottoms wise. I have quite a long leg and I'm quite bootylicious <laughs> as it were so I do have to be careful with where I get my jeans and stuff from. Please tell me what you think down in the comments. I really like some of these blazers. Some of them are absolutely amazing and I am so glad that I am able to upgrade my wardrobe and I really, really hope that you'll stay with me for this little journey that I'm going on. I will have videos about my clear outs coming up as well and with me doing that, I am getting some bits actually onto eBay because I want it in auction style, any profits that I'm actually making from anything that I sell. So profits that after postage, guys, then I will actually be donating it to a charity. Some of the clothes I could have just taken to a charity store, but I actually want you guys to have some of this stuff as well. And the last time I actually went to a charity store, they actually said, oh, we can't take any more women's clothes because we're full. We don't have anywhere to put them. So I was like, oh, okay, fair enough. Seems like everybody has been trying to get rid of stuff. So that's what I'm doing at the minute. Everything that I've got is slowly trickling through onto eBay. Any profits I make will be going to a charity. So if you did like this video, do feel free to give it a great big thumbs up, show it some love. I'd really appreciate it. And if you've not already, because I know, I know over 80% of you that watch my videos regularly haven't subscribed yet, so subscribe down below and while you're there click the notification button. You don't have to do anything other than click the button, it's absolutely free. And then when a new video comes up, my face will show up, or one of my thumbnails, probably not like my entire face being like, ah, but you know, it'll be, um, it'll be there on your YouTube and you won't have to search for me in the search bar. But everything is down in the description if you did like anything, so go and have a look. Some of it was on sale, like I said, so some of it might not be there, but there's always a suggested stuff at the bottom of the little search thing that she does, which is really, really cool. So thank you so much for watching, guys. Take care, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!